Hey guys, I get asked a lot about certain diets. And one of the diets that people ask me about is the carnivore diet. Now, should you do a carnivore diet? And I think the answer is it depends. A lot of it depends on your current situation. You know, do you have a lot of joint pain? Are you metabolically unstable? Do you have diabetes? Um, that can be, the carnivore diet can be used to help treat these uh, kind of conditions. But like with any diet, I don't think you need to be set on just one diet for the rest of your life. I think you can use different diets at different times using, using them as tools. I think that with the carnivore diet, it's something that I use personally uh, to help kind of reset uh, my uh, underlying metabolic uh, system. And what I mean by that is like over the holidays, for instance, if I was to uh, eat more of things I shouldn't eat, which I did, most, uh, I like most people, you know, you can use the carnivore diet to kind of reset your uh, system. And uh, what it does is it gets rid of all the processed foods. I mean, it gets rid of the excess sugar uh, that's in your system. Now, am I going to do the carnivore diet the rest of my life? No, I'm not going to do that. Um, I like to have salads. I like to have other things as well, too. But at times uh, during the year, uh, I'm going to use a carnivore diet either for a few days or maybe even up to a week or two. And what it does, it, it kind of like, it gets me back to where I need to be, get the sugar out, and it helps me do a detox. Is it hard to begin with? Sometimes it is. And when I first started doing a carnivore diet, I, I initially thought, man, this is going to be great. I'm going to eat meat all the time. But over time, I kind of got tired of just eating meat. Now, I have some clients and patients who do a carnivore diet all the time and, and you know if you're doing what we call nose to tail uh, you're going to get your vitamins that you need to get from that you know and that includes eating like livers and uh, having bone broth and things like that because uh, those contain some of the important vitamins that you need to get so when we're talking about diets uh, whether it be carnivore keto paleo doesn't matter what it is uh, what we need to understand is we can use these at certain times uh, you know, follow us along. Um, I think we're going to probably do an extended podcast on the carnivore diet, exactly what it is and how to do it. So if you're interested in those, uh, subscribe and you'll be the first to know. But before I end this, one question I'd really like to know is, have you ever tried the carnivore diet and what was your experience with it? Now, you may not know exactly what the carnivore diet is and what to eat on it. And that's what our future podcast is going to bring to you. I uh, look forward to seeing you, serving you, and you guys have a blessed day.